What's going on guys? It's time for some more Tank Tucker. We dominated the Minnesota Gophers last episode and now we're going to travel to Texas to take on the Rice Owls in our second game of the season. Alright, here we are in Houston, Texas. Ready to take on the Rice Owls. On the road. We'll take the ball. It don't matter. Man, they got a lot of holes in this crowd. There ain't that many people here. That is unacceptable. These people on the road, or these people in Houston, Texas, don't want to come out to see Tank Tucker, the phenom. There we go. Look at him break the tackle and catch the ball. And he gets a first down. He is just a dynamic running back. He can block, he can catch, he can run, he can tackle. We've seen him pass on a couple of occasions. Here we go. Coming over the middle. Oh boy, we're going deep. Left side. Oh, great play by the defender over there to knock that ball away. That was actually pretty impressive, I have to say. Man, I have a lot of fun playing these Tank Tucker games. I really want to play some on Madden as well. Hey, wow, they're showing up pretty well on this first drive. But yeah, I want to play some of this on Madden. Um, actually, one thing I've been doing is I don't even upgrade Tank anymore because I don't think it'd be that much fun to play football with a 99 every attribute character and good job runner so I don't plan on upgrading tank anymore besides fatigue injury and maybe maybe a couple other attributes but like I don't want to have 99 speed 99 strength 99 everything that to me wouldn't be that much fun so I'm kinda content with the player I have right now on Madden I'll be content with having him at a like a mid 90s overall something like that I know it's not that hard to get your guy a 99 overall, and so I'm just trying to keep the game fun. You guys know how I do it with a lot of my different games, series, whatever you want to call it. All right, here we go. First and ten, and nice catch. We are we have come out flat against the Rice Owls. We are getting outplayed right now. I'm surprised they didn't score on their last drive. They had pretty good field position after that fumble. The wide open in the flats, and Renner is like. Yo, let's just throw an incomplete pass. That's pretty cool. That's pretty neat. Alright, third and ten. What miraculous throw of you? I'm gonna try this time. Are you kidding me? Oh, we got eight yards. And we're gonna go for it, because we've been playing so well up to this point, we might as well just not punt. Here it goes, Tank Tucker. Jesus, gotta do some power running. Running into my blockers all over the place, but we do manage to get the first down. And that's what counts. So first and ten. Out of the backfield. Oh, they got two guys coming over to me. I'm not open. Don't throw it to me. Hey, nice drop, bro. And now I have to come off the field. And we punted. How are we playing so bad against Rice? We should not be letting a team from Conference USA hang with us. And there's Tank Tucker. You're not catching him. Great route. Great catch. Touchdown, Tank. We got the first points on the board. And hopefully that means that we're going to start routing these guys like we should have been all along. Whoa! Excuse me, you just want to score 15 points or whatever you just scored when I'm not on the field? 12 points? It's early in the morning. I can't count. Anyways, we scored a bunch of points when I wasn't playing. Ah, yeah, sorry, I couldn't pick up the backside pressure. That's not my fault. I had to carry out a fake to freeze the linebackers, and it didn't work. Oh boy, look at all this green in the middle of the field. Thank you. Go deep, deep. Renner, you're an idiot! Oh my god! The closest guy to me was the cameraman! That is ridiculous. Here it goes. Toss out right. And there's a juke making him look silly. Adrian Peterson style. And apparently Tank Tucker is gassed. Second and 13. Let's go. Snap the ball. And they're covering me. And you throw it to me anyways. What happened when I was wide open? You're blind. I got three carries in the first half. You kidding me? Against Rice. Here we go. 
first down. I'm not surprised. I'm leaving the field again. What were you doing last night, Tank? That you can only stay on the field for a couple plays at a time. Timeout called. All right, we're running the ball some more. Let's get some yards. We got to get that Heisman Trophy. Oh, look at that. <laughs> One tiny little cut. And you're gone. Yeah, get out of Tank's way. He'll just fold you up like a cheeseburger and shove you in his mouth. Not a pleasant situation. Here we go, first and ten. And Rice is finally getting destroyed the way they should have. And there's a deep pass, right side. What's up? Oh, I was going to nail that guy. I might have gotten called for a penalty. Not like I'm worried about that, but... Yeah, I'm probably not going to play too much of this second half. Because we have just been routing the Rice Owls. Here goes a handoff. I'm going to kill you. Oh, I couldn't even block that guy. Oh! Oh! No! <laughs> if I could have blocked that guy, he would have been gone. That's called giving it your all right there. You don't see too many running backs going out and trying to block safeties. Because it's not their job. <laughs> first and ten. Hand off to the most powerful running back in the nation. And great block. You're going to go to the NFL. You're probably going to be a first round draft pick NFL Hall of Famer. You're awful. Here it goes. I want to kill that guy. Oh, I missed him. Got a lot of hostility towards these guys. Here it goes. Oh, cut over in the middle. Oh, what are you throwing it at? Jesus. Third and three. Here we go. Hand off to Tank. There we go. Up the middle. First and goal, please stay on the field. We'll do the pass play. I don't want to toss. I bet you they're going to cover it perfectly too. So I'm going to cut up field. Oh, great job, you're sacked. And I have to leave the field after running a 10 yard route. And I'm on the field now, it's 40 to 0. They have a chance of not giving up 50. Oh, what the hell is our line doing? These boys from Texas are kind of dominating us in the trenches, but we're better talent-wise. Oh, ho -ho, got you turned around. You know what to do. You ain't never played against the 400 and some odd pound running back. Here it goes, out of the backfield, oh, you're hit as you throw, and Renner's pass was complete for seven yards. End of the third quarter. We got one quarter of play left against the Rice Owls. Oh, that's stupid. One thing I don't like about college football at all is tune-up games. I cannot stand them. I, mean, like, I don't want to watch Oklahoma play against Ball State, okay? You ever fought? Are you, you like over 18 and ever fought like a 12 year old? That's pretty much what it is. Nobody wants to watch that. I don't even know why they're allowed to schedule those type of games. They're a joke. I mean, Rice had no chance. 47 nothing. Just spanked them. Okay, so final stats on the day. Only nine carries, but a buck 41 on the ground, two rushing touchdowns, 68 yards receiving, and one receiving touchdown. So that's a good game for our bid in the Heisman Trophy standings, even though it's only our second game of the season. All right, well, I just unlocked this trophy here, Campus Legend. In Road to Glory mode, earn a spot on your team's all-time leaderboard. I'll have to check that out. 
And here's what they were talking about. Fifth on these offline leaderboards. I'm not sure what all this really means. But I want to try to crack that online leaderboard. I know my legend score isn't that high, but I know I can get it higher. Alright, well next game is against the Temple Owls. And that is actually where Bill Cosby went to college, if you didn't know that. There's a fun fact for you. So next episode, we take on the Temple Owls. Try to go 3-0 and and prepare ourselves for ACC Conference play. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode, and I will see you guys next time.